I think some of my inspiration intellectually came from my brother. He was older than me and, and so he was already, he was always in front of me academically uh, and, and that was of course a challenge. Some part of me that enjoyed the, 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 the sort of intellectual challenge of, of doing mathematics and doing science in general, but uh, for a long part of my life uh, I, I didn't know that, I mean, that, that being a mathematician was something that you could actually be. My field of study is, is mathematical physics. I study the, the, the mathematics behind quantum mechanics. Especially these years, I'm very interested in, in, in cold Bose gases, Bose-Einstein condensation, which is a phenomenon which has been it was predicted by Bose and Einstein a very, very long time ago, but it became experimentally realizable in, 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 in the 90s. Uh, but we still don't really understand uh, these uh, th these things from a mathematical perspective. For my research, uh, computing power is, 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 is not important because uh, when you have this very large number of particles, then computers simply cannot simulate this, uh, not, not with a degree of precision that you can trust. You have to, to, to uh, see how you can extract the right information uh, from the equations themselves without doing experiments on a computer. This is really uh, uh, old, uh, old-fashioned brain work. The mission of the Institute of doing basic research just for the fact of improving human knowledge, that is very, very important to me as a scientist. I think it's very interesting to, to, to look at the, the Institute webpage and see that already from when this Institute was started, this was their mission and maybe also something that they really had to fight for. And I think that fight goes on today. Uh, you can read these early papers by, by people who were, were, were here at the beginning and, and they are equally relevant today.